Let's improve relations because I reckon if I get the relations right, you probably will. <laughs> I'm forcing re religious change throughout my empire because, you know, it's what it's there for. Right, I can either take money or I could get. Uh, we'll take one of those. So, actually, I haven't had a look at these guys recently. I could have a inflation dude, which could be useful. I think I'll stick the discipline blokey there. I'll stick with what I've got for the moment. What's up, Blazing Cyclone? Wow, 31 people watching. That's cool. Thank you all for your time. Much appreciated. Is there anybody else left for me to sit on? Not so much. So we'll get these troops back home. We'll get ready for... I think there'll be another HRE war actually, because I think I want to force through as many reforms as quickly as possible while uh, the getting's good. Right. Brabant. What can I get from you? Are you the wrong religion? No, you're not. So all I really want from you is war reparations and cash and we'll also end all your alliances because we're mean no you're not going to go for that, right, we'll give it a minute because you will <laughs> we're earning prestige just by breaking alliances such a big bully That's the point. Is anybody sat on Frankfurt at the moment? Yes, Netherlands are. That's good. Where's the best return on investment? That's a 4.07, that's not bad. That's a 4.57, that's probably the one we're going to go for. In fact, we'll build both. I don't mind investing in my uh, economy. Strangely. Because being broke was not fun. Oh, new follower, awesome. Yeah, Polish Huvian, yes, there is. I, I've only got till 1820 to achieve what I can do, to do what I can do. Wow, Polish Huvian, thank you for the follow. And there's another follow in there, let's see who that was. Blazing Cyclone, thank you for the follow, really appreciate it. Right, Brabant. Now, we had this discussion just now. You know, the one where you were going to give me your money, which is now more money, and end all your alliances. And uh, that's exactly what you're going to do now. Thank you. Culture and religious map mode. Okay. First off, the religious. Catholic is winning and then some uh, so there's Kath, that's that I managed to destroy most of the uh, 
nearby uh, centers of the Reformation. I'll work on the rest. Um, cultural. And I can quickly order that by cultures I like. There you go. So yeah, it's going not too bad. Yeah, France is um, not as strong as normal, and I will be attacking them before too long. But at the moment I'm bullying the HRE about so I can pass more uh, reforms quickly. In fact, let's see if there's anybody who will just go for a religious change. Oldenburg, would you change your religion? As soon as I get... Oh yes, that gets rid of a centre of a... I think that just got rid of a centre of... Yes it did, I just got rid of a religious centre. That was a coup. Saxony is the wrong religion, this is true. I'm going to attack Saxony because I want to release Onhalt and it'll help me. But that just got rid of a centre of religious whatever the heck, so yeah, this is going well. It's only going to be that one and this one down here left. And I'm going to work on that one. <laughs> yeah. Hey, it's diplomacy of a type. And at the end of the day, I am English. Our diplomacy through a lot of this period was send gunboats, scare the natives, make them do what you want. Ah, they're not going to go for it. May need need to find some way of. If I can get my prest no, my prestige is pretty much max. I'll check one back when I've got a hundred prestige, which I will have shortly. Ah, excellent. We'll be able to attack the Hulser soon and release Bremen. Right, who have we got left in this fight? Pez912, thank you for the follow buddy, really appreciate it. Can someone explain how four 10k religious zealots are going through my country Poland to fight the invading Sweden and Danish in control? Uh, no idea. Faro's on. Thank you for the follow buddy, really appreciate. Right, Frankfurt. Sue for peace. You're the right religion, so don't need to do that. Right. Now, Switzerland. Oh! Minus 14. No, oh, not vassalization. I want to change their religion. 
Nope, they're at zero. I would need one more. That sucks so much. Just love how there's three Polands. Yeah. I'm, uh, they're now my vassals, so I will be feeding feeding them back their cores soon. Cleves, you're the wrong religion, you know. Sorry to break break this to you. Okay, let's start looking at what we're going to do to these guys. Right, release nations. Cologne is a release. War reparations, cash. And we'll give fouls back to the Palatinate. And blends to Trier. None of these are going to cost anything, so we'll give all these things back to these people. Which will make them like me. Job done. Uh, Poland did stood strong for a long time, Hoovian, but then, uh... <laughs> yeah, got to use the things that are there. Right, who's next on my get wrecked list? Nah, not worth it. Um, right, you guys. Can I attack you? Yes, I can. That'll pull in the Hansa. That's cool. Uh, Magdeburg, but not Bremen. Right, we want a free Anhalt. So that's a good start. So we're breaking all the countries down. Uh, Pass any reforms now. Uh, four. Very quickly passing reforms now that I'm not under the cosh. <laughs> Bla uh, blazing, I don't think that was on the basis of religion somehow. Anti-Semitism, partially. Um, changing Versailles, partially. Because he's complete nutter, that's a large part of it. Right, straight into a war to release on halt. So what I want to do is make everything released that I can. Magdeburg, Magdeburg, Magdeburg. What religion are you? Good, we can change your religion. Hansa, what religion are you? Probably the wrong one. And we can get you to release stuff. So this is a good war. This is a good war. We're going to do this. Free East Frisia. At the moment, but Netherlands are my buddies and they're going to help me against France. And possibly against Great Britain. And probably against Denmark, so we're going to leave them alone for the moment.
right.